Good morning, good afternoon, and good evening. I'm here with my top secret wife, Laura. And I'm here with my guessing husband, Nathan. And we're here with a bag of mystery flavor Doritos. We sure are. There was Pringles that were a mystery. There was mystery Mentos, and now we have top secret Doritos. Yeah, so basically this is test flavor 855. Mm. And as per usual, there is a competition behind this. If you can guess what flavor it is, you got a chance to win $10,000. Yes, so we are going to be a bold taste tester and guess, well, hopefully, <laughs> their newest flavor straight from the lab. Ooh. Now this competition doesn't start until the 25th of, uh, where are we? January, March, eight. May. May. <laughs> Um, we did take a quick look at the ingredients here. We'll see if we can... Uh, the only things we could see that were sort of of note was herb, spices, garlic powder, onion powder, and rosemary extract. Everything else is kind of your standard, you Colourings know, flavours and, and, and such. So, mmm, it's red. Maybe that's a clue. I don't know. Yeah, Something could... spicy. Um, we picked this up from Woolworths in Australia, mm -hmm. but it'll probably be available at other major supermarkets hopefully possibly yeah yes so we're gonna taste and we'll attempt bold. to guess probably getting it wrong but hey we'll give it a we'll give it a shot hmm it doesn't really give much away it's, um it smells it's, like original like plain but Doritos. So, so, a hint of something else in there mm. not quite and they look a bit lighter I'll try and get a flat one so we can see yeah it looks it looks like herbs you know, yeah. you, you would sprinkle herbs on something like that has that herb sort of appearance. or something. Oh, my. imagine if that was it and you'd just guess. Because that <laughs> would have probably like, you know, onion or garlic or rosemary, you know, on top of your focaccia. Hmm. Tastes meaty. Yeah, some sort of meat. And there's quite a lot of herbs seasoning on it. Mm hmm. Hmm. But it's not really. Very heavy on the herbs. But not really distinctive. What's a bit meaty mm. with lots of herbs? All <laughs> I can think of is like a, a tapas or a Greek sort of something or other. I, uh, well, mm. tapas isn't a food. <laughs> a so, type of food. <laughs> well, but tapas can be so many different things. It's really not that helpful. Um, I don't know. It's kind of a hard flavour to describe. There's a lot of herbs. I'm not. By the time I got through that whole Dorito... I was less confident about the meaty part. <laughs> I mean, the um, the flavouring disappears quite quickly and you end up with just sort of a plain sort of Dorito. Mm. But I can't quite pick my finger on it. It's not very strong, whatever it is. Like, it, overall flavour. Mmm. I don't know. It's quite salty. Mm. Salted herb Doritos. <laughs> Seems like a weird flavour for them to have people guess, though, right? Like... Herb and salt seems just like something they would bring out rather than something that they would want people to, to, to think about and guess for. So what, um, what we can gather is it's got some sort of meat. Maybe. And I'm less confident about that now. I don't know. Whatever it has, has lots of herb flavourings. Mmm. I think we had, even though I don't think we were necessarily right with some of the previous mystery items that we've tried on the channel, um, we had a more like solid idea of what at least we thought they were this one i'm kind of up in the air i don't it's not it's not that far away from some of their regular flavors i don't know I, I think it is that that sort of salty herb mm. flavor you know it'd be really funny if it was indeed a focaccia and you just got it because that would be salty because you have like the salt on the top of them and, and sometimes <laughs> you've got garlic and things like herbs that and all of that look i want to know what your guesses are to the audience. <laughs> Hopefully someone has a better better idea than we do because I'm but, not sure. They're nice. Yeah, but so they're worth trying even if you're not going to enter the competition, no, I would say. Because they're, yeah. They're actually, they're a nice flavour. I just wish I knew what it was. We'll just have to wait until... Uh, Goes for ages, the competition. Ends all in July. Okay, so we're going to be waiting a little while. If you enjoyed watching this video, give us a thumbs up. Let us know in the comment section um, if you want to your thoughts on them after you try them. What yeah. do you think can they you, taste like? Can you describe them better than we can? Because we're having a really hard time determining. Yeah, we're going to be way off, obviously. <laughs> Hit that subscribe button and check back soon. We have videos every Monday and Saturday. Sounds good. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.